Thanks for tuning in. This is my Vision Red News. Please subscribe, like the video. If possible, enable your notification bell for more from my Vision Red News. Now let's get into this. Yo, let's dive deep into this Drake situation because man, there's a lot to unpack here. It's like somebody really needs to grab Drake by the shoulders and have a real heart to heart with him. You feel me? Cause it seems like homeboy just can't catch a break lately and it's starting to show in his music. Now I'm all for artists evolving and trying out new sounds, but Drake's recent moves have got me scratching my head, to say the least. I mean, the guy's been dropping tracks left and right, like it's going out of style, but instead of elevating his game, he's just digging himself into a deeper hole. And trust me, it's not a good look. Let's start with this latest joint he put out, the one with Snow Day. Now, on the surface, it might seem like a dope collab, right? Two Toronto artists coming together to represent their city, what's not to love? But then you actually listen to the track, and you realize that it's just lacking. There's no fire, no passion, none of that signature Drake magic that we're used to. And speaking of signature Drake magic, let's talk about how he's been moving lately. Remember when Kendrick Lamar called him out for jumping on trends from other regions while neglecting his roots? Yeah, that was a wake-up call for a lot of people, including Drake himself, or so we thought. But instead of taking that criticism to heart and using it as fuel to come back stronger, Drake seems to be doubling down on the very things Kendrick called him out for. I mean, just look at the direction he's been going with his music lately. Instead of staying true to his roots and repping for his city, he's been chasing after whatever sound is hot at the moment, even if it means sacrificing his own authenticity in the process. And don't even get me started on those cringe-worthy attempts at diss tracks. It's like he's trying so hard to prove himself to his critics that he's forgotten what made him great in the first place. But here's the thing, Drake's always been a polarizing figure in the game. You either love him or you hate him, there's no in-between. And while he's had his fair share of highs and lows throughout his career, this feels different. It feels like he's lost his way, like he's struggling to find his footing in an industry that's constantly evolving. Now don't get me wrong, I'm not saying that Drake's washed up or anything like that. The man's still got talent, there's no denying that. But talent alone isn't enough to sustain a career in this game. You gotta have heart, you gotta have passion, and most importantly, you gotta have authenticity. And right now, it feels like Drake's lacking in all three departments. So where does he go from here? That's the million dollar question, my friend. Some people think he needs to take a step back, reevaluate his priorities, and come back stronger than ever. Others think he needs to hang up the mic for good and call it a day. Me? I'm somewhere in the middle. I think Drake still has the potential to make some dope music, but he's gotta write his own lyrics, get back to his roots, and remember what made him great in the first place. At the end of the day, it's up to Drake to decide what he wants to do with his career. He can either continue down this path of self-destruction, or he can take a step back, reassess, and come back stronger than ever. The choice is his, but whatever he decides, I just hope he does it with integrity and authenticity. That's all we can ask for as fans. Tell us what you guys think below in the comments. Please subscribe, like, share, and enable your notification bell for more from my Vision Red News.